Hello everyone, welcome back to my uh, dev vlog series and uh, I decided to, you know, the most effective way I'm gonna keep making video and document the development of the game is to just record me record me speaking, doing commentary and instead of like making fully edited videos or sprite animation because that's just too time consuming and uh, I don't really have a lot of time as a college student but anyway, fellow solo devs if you are planning on making assets or the assets yourself and doing everything yourself, uh, I guess that's what solo dev means. But if you plan on making music yourself, I want you to uh, very consider that because uh, I, in the last video I've been to I talk about how I want to do some music training, like composition practicing, and yeah, I've been doing that. But uh, also, I want to like just tell you how freaking that frustrating it is to like just think about how to compose you know as a solo dev i had to like focus on uh, you know programming game design uh, and like image assets and music assets it's a lot of thing to work on and on top of that i had to do music now music like uh some people uh, ask me if uh, music takes if music is like harder than pixel art and uh, the reply I gave to them was it takes just as much time to learn music at some degree I think that's true but uh, now that I thought about it uh, I feel like music is kind of harder because like you know people like do doodles and stuff like they draw on their papers and everything when they're like bored uh, like as a child because drawing is like a, a way more accessible thing but music, on the other hand, you need to have like an instrument or like you gotta actually practice it. And I don't think people like just like compose like a tune when they're bored. So like music is like objectively less accessible and therefore harder. I don't know if that makes sense. Or I'm just saying things, but uh, I generally do think now. I now generally do think that music is harder to learn and harder to make. So for the past week or two, I've been like doing music. I've been like practicing as well as like actually making assets for my uh, game project Bravo Plus and I've got some nice results and I also struggled a lot like a lot a lot <laughs> like uh, I composed this uh, music the grassland kind of music and uh, it has a vibe that I want to capture and it went pretty well it's not a particularly long song but I think that's fine because sticking to a low scope uh, helped me helps me actually finishing. I also composed an underwater song and a forest song. Now these three songs went pretty well because uh, they kind of just come together pretty quickly. But there's also two other songs that I want to make but I just couldn't. Uh, the first being the cave music. Cave is kind of like easy but like I kind of want it to have some kind of energetic vibe instead of these moody vibes that usual cave music have and sky music I wanted to have some kind of athletic vibes to it and that's where I found out I actually have trouble like composing like energetic or athletic vibes of music so like for this two song I kind of just spent a lot of time thinking about how to compose it before actually giving up I didn't just like give up out of nowhere I actually go look at other people's work like if you want to like learn music you kind of have to like just listen to music or check out how other people do it in this case, I use Family Tracker to compose, and I kind of just look onto Family Tracker forums and see other people's songs, how what kind of effects they use. Sometimes they use a lot of freaking instruments and <laughs> a lot of effects, like it's a lot of modules, and, and I just cannot uh, understand what the hell are they doing. Uh, in some instances, uh, they use. 2A03 which is like just vanilla I can kind of just read it uh, very quickly but that doesn't necessarily mean I can like do it myself so uh, come up with melody is like an easy thing but like having them somewhere together with other instruments is another challenge in itself and I'm kind of really having trouble with that so like you know composers can kind of just have like different instruments jumping between notes and they can they can really sound well together but like I just have no idea how they do it like how do I know what kind of notes sound well together what kind of pitch sound well together like how do I do the chords thing like I do chords but like uh, they are very simple chords there's nothing too interesting to them I don't know if composers went through this but I guess I kind of had to go through several hours of just not being able to make music not being able to compose the stuff I want you know creative things like ideas like you kind of just sometimes you just gotta let it 
come out itself. Like it's kind of like an argument. Like you can you cannot think crap like during the actual argument, but when you were like asleep, that in the middle of the night, you suddenly come up with a very valid argument. I think I think that's kind of how well, like how creative process works. But anyway, I, I really have trouble working with music, and then I eventually decided to give up because I just cannot work out for the time being. Maybe later, maybe. But for now, I decided to take one of the old tracks I made and uh, do a re little rearrangement or remix. That I don't know the term, but uh, I did a little changes to that and now it fits and so more energetic. And yet, for the past few weeks, I feel like I've been like squeezing my brain to do music. You know, I was planning on making, doing like a one month music practice, but I've been squeezing my brain for music like way too much at this point. I feel like I should just go back to my regular old game dev and start work on stuff. My current goal is to like make a small product, like small but minimum viable product, because it's not even correct to say that. I want to make a full game, but like it's a very bite-sized one. And uh, I've once considered to have this be a commercial project. I'm also considering for it to not be one, you know, kind of just be a little game, like a f completely free game, just so uh, people can play them and see how awesome I am as a, a game dev and they can follow me. Like, I kind of just make this game to get, like, I guess, clout. <laughs> uh, I really don't want to use that word, but <laughs> uh, right now I really need to get, like, some following. I feel like uh, having this game be free and then putting a lot of efforts and polish into it can uh, really help and help people see uh, my capabilities so my future games can like actually get more uh, attraction so anyway uh, that's my current goal and uh, I guess I will probably make more of this type of video but for the time being I'm gonna stop right here and this is all I have time for today and I'll see you in the next one Thank you.